Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I know you wouldn't expect this from the thumbnail, right? Well, today's video we are testing frozen makeup. I was inspired by Sylvia, my good friend. Um, she did this challenge and I was like, oh my god, I want to try it out. I froze my makeup overnight, 24 hours. Okay, this is my second time filming this video. Do not ask why, but let's go ahead and get started. Do not forget to subscribe and purchase my palette if you have not. You guys will see what happened with my palette later on in the video, but let's go ahead and get started. Okay, y'all, so we're about to go and check the freezer. It has been over 24 hours. You know, my dumbass, I put the makeup in at like 11 p.m. and I was like, oh my God, I'm gonna open it up the next day at 11 a.m. It's gonna be 24 hours. <laughs> There's just only 12, I'm stupid. So I'm refilming this video. Let's go ahead and check it out, come on. Okay, so, oh bitch, this is cold. <gasps> no! Oh my God, it's completely frozen. And we're just going to go ahead and try to do a full face of frozen makeup. Hopefully, I don't break out. Maybe I- Ow, bitch, what the fuck? Rude as fuck. <laughs> okay, guys, so I have the full box of frozen makeup right in front of me. I just want to go ahead and look at my palette. <gasps> I want to see how it's- Oh, 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 bitch. <gasps> oh my god, the shimmer shadows, they have left- the chat it's completely frozen like they do not even want to swatch oh the matte one still kind of looks okay okay the matte one is still good but bitch oh my god this is so freaking exciting i have never been more excited to try on frozen makeup <laughs> but we're gonna go ahead and start off with eyebrows here i have the benefit kaboo brow let's see <gasps> oh wait it actually works oh wait you know what I feel like this definitely did get darker or something. It probably oxidized. Or I don't know what the fuck because <laughs> these eyebrows are gonna be way too dark for my blonde hair. Let me go ahead and zoom y'all in. <laughs> Bitch, this fucking eyebrow. No mames. I've never seen my eyebrows this bad before. Bitch, this makeup is about to be a fucking mess. I can already tell. This is coming off like super powdery and chalky instead of being like a pomade you know how pomades are really like creamy this kind of feels like a frozen powder or something i don't know how to describe the texture of this, this is so weird um well maybe let's try to clean up my eyebrows hopefully that will help oh okay well the concealer definitely didn't freeze love that oh because she's cold like super cold oh my god my eyebrows are frozen and suddenly i don't know how to carve them out what am i doing with my life right now I can't stop laughing because my eyebrows just look like, so bad. You know, that's as best as the eyebrows are gonna get. Okay, so next up is primer. Here we have the Too Faced Hangover Primer. <gasps> Let's see if we at least get. Oh, no, 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 no. <gasps> oh my god, I think I just chipped my tooth. Oh my god, my tooth chipped. Oh my god, bitch, what the fuck? Did y'all hear that? <gasps> so we have the knife right here. I'm gonna cut through it. Oh, I got it, I got it. All right, <laughs> I'm gonna use the product like this. Oh my god, this is literally like freaking mochi or something. <gasps> Look at it, I can like mold it. Oh my god, this is so weird. Oh my god, let me try to... Oh my god, this feels like... Oh, bitch, like fucking cold ass crema. And now let's move on to the foundation. I have two foundations here. I have the Beauty Blender foundation and then I have the Derma Blend Flawless Creator Multi-Purpose Use Drops. Okay, now. Okay, so it's like, it's still there. Let me see if this one still works. Oh! Okay, so the Beauty Blender one definitely does not work. It's like frozen. This shit will not come out. All right, so let's go ahead and try to use this foundation. <gasps> oh, that is This actually feels really nice, though. It kind of feels like a facial. Am I really a facial, you know? Ew, do y'all see that? It's so clumpy. Oh my god, I literally feel like I'm putting frosting on my skin, that's exactly what it feels like. It has the consistency of frosting. My mom called me, she's like, what are you doing? I was like, nada, nomás poniendo mi maquillaje congelado. <laughs> she had no idea what I was talking about. I'm gonna move on to concealer. 
The concealer pretty much stayed kind of the same. I feel like it probably just became really sheer. Oh my god, all these products look so crazy on my skin. I also put a ColourPop concealer in here just to see if the consistency would be different. It pretty much looks the same. I just wonder if I like oxidized or something. Oh. Okay, so the ColourPop one didn't really change. I just, I feel like the ColourPop one actually got a little bit more intense. Oh, bitch, but this shit looks so blotchy. Oh my god, my makeup looks disgusting right now. <gasps> oh, I need y'all to see this up close. Oh my god. Ew. Do y'all see how cakey this shit looks? <laughs> <laughs> bitch, and then I look like Angry Bird with my fucking eyebrows. <laughs> I can't, I can't with myself. So I went ahead and I put the Hourglass Veil Translucent Powder in there. Let's go ahead and take some out. Oh my god, the translucent powder is really clumping up together. Alright, so meanwhile, this is baking a little. We're going to go ahead and move on to the eyes. I already know that this base is going to be horrible for the eyeshadow. Like, I do not have high hopes for the eyeshadows at all. So here's a Daisy Marquez palette. I don't know if you guys could see the little droplets on here. It's really wet. You know what I should have done? I should have put brushes in the freezer too. I wonder if that would work the same. Okay, let's go ahead. Oh, oh, the eyeshadow still don't work exactly the same. It's probably, you know what I'm thinking? It's probably the shimmers that are just not going to be the same. Oh, actually, you know what? Now that they're like melting down a little bit, the swatches are exactly the same. Oh yeah. All right, bitch. Well, the Daisy Marquez palette definitely survived the challenge. We love her. Um, probably the next challenge I will do is the microwave challenge. I'm gonna try to microwave my makeup. See how that works out. My battery is about to die right now. So I'm gonna just do a burnt eye all over my lid. If you have not purchased my palette, you definitely need to because it is freaking bomb. Um, so I'm gonna let my camera charge for a little bit and then I'm going to be right back. Okay, so we are back. I just took off the translucent powder right now. Um, probably the only thing I noticed is that I look really, really matte and usually this powder makes you look really dewy. Um, so the next product we're going to use is this bronzer right here. This is from Wet n Wild. This bronzer still works exactly the same. Nothing much has changed. If you're wondering for my eyes, I used Vintage and Dulce. I did just have a really quick and hi there. Simple Hachiro's kind of inspired look. Um, the reason why I'm inspired by Hachiro's right now is because bitch. Look, I'm a motherfucking keys, bitch. I got a fucking freaking Hachiro right here on my little keychain, and then I have some freaking tacos way. Are you freaking kidding me? I will have these little products linked down below. They're so freaking cute. They're all handmade. These are my car keys over here, bitch. Get on my fucking level. Duvalin, we have Mazapan, a concha. And then look at my freaking focus. Concha, so freaking cute. I wish they had like a Tiffany blue concha. Bitch, I'd be living my best life. Okay, so this definitely is not going to like melt anytime soon. This is definitely out of the picture. But I did freeze this loose highlighter and then the Mary Luminizer. I wonder if the Mary Luminizer like has changed. I feel like it's gonna lose its consistency. Oh. Oh, actually, it actually made the highlighter look really wet and nice. Wow, I'm surprised. It doesn't look bad at all, huh? Oh my God, you know what, bitch? Look, oh, oh my God, this jelly highlighter. Oh, oh my God, it's literally like pudding. It's like hard pudding. <gasps> that is so weird. Oh, 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 I feel like this is way more intense now. Oh my God, my dumbass. I should have used this before I even applied my foundation. That's a cute moment. Cute. Oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh man, that just made my cheeks look so fucking weird. Mm, that's crazy, bitch. Crazy. Oh, 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 fuck. <laughs> I swear, I drop a product every single time I'm filming. Okay, so now we're gonna open up the mas the mascara. Oh. Oh! Oh my god, it broke! Shut the fuck up. Oh my god. Oh my god. Well, we completely lost the mascara wand in there. Okay, yeah. Let's see if the eyelash glue. Oh, oh, 
we got it to work. Ha 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 ha, bitch. Oh fuck, but it's completely dry. It's just like a huge chunk. It's not liquidy, nothing's coming out. All right, well, let's check out the eyelashes. I have high hopes for the eyelashes, you know. I'm pretty sure they're just gonna keep its shape really nice. Oh no, actually the lashes, well, I'm sorry. The lashes are actually still exactly the same. I'm just gonna go ahead and add a little bit of... Okay, well, I'm just gonna glue on these eyelashes and I'll be right back so I can keep charging my camera because it's flashing in red. Okay, so I went ahead and I applied the lashes. Um, I actually like them better frozen. I feel like it held the shape up more. I just went ahead and added just regular mascara. And then for the lower lash line, I really like this look, y'all. It's really, really pretty. Um, so I added Bittersweet on the outer edges only, and I only dragged it like three-fourths, and I feel like it gives me such a pretty cat eye effect. Now I'm going to go ahead and try out one of the shimmers. So I'm going to go ahead and grab Stunt. I'm going to put that... Oh my god, this is literally giving me hot cheeto vibes. I don't know why. I put in this Anastasia, oh my god, it's so freaking cold. This Anastasia, oh my god, the silver part is so freaking cold. Um, Bohemian liquid lipstick. Oh, it's so goopy. Oh, okay. I'm just gonna go in. <laughs> I applied this so <laughs> You know what, that's as best as I can put this lipstick on. Uh -oh. Oh my god, it is so sticky. All right, so that pretty much completes the entire look. It did not come out as bad as I thought it was. The only issue is that we did break a little bit of products. We broke the mascara. The glue completely did not work. The <laughs> jelly highlighter, it's still solid frozen. It's like Play-Doh, really goopy. The foundation just did get really, really cakey. And overall, I think this makeup came out pretty this is actually perfect for single day you know so yeah that is it for this video thank you guys so much for watching if you guys want me to do the microwave challenge where i microwave the makeup i don't know if that's safe enough uh let me know in the comments down below see if you guys want to see that video but do not forget to subscribe click down below if you want to purchase my palette it's only 23 dollars it's fucking bomb and it's freeze resistant yeah I just tested that out anyways that is it for this video hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you guys next time bye guys why do I keep putting up? Oh my god, but you can see my hot chill fingers from last night. I don't know why I keep putting up the peace sign. Anyways, okay, peace. <laughs>